Hey folks, Turbine Guy back at you today. Today we're going to have a little bit of fun. If you all know, the most recent video I did was about the Alico slash Titemar wind turbine out of China. Titemar supposedly being bankrupt last year or something. And if you want to see that video, you, you can look in the link uh, in the description we put. But what we're going to do today is it, it pushed me into deciding I'm going to order one of these and I'm going to test it and I'm going to see how cheap it really is, if you can still get one, if it works, whatever. And you know, what I figured the best place to order, Amazon. They got them on Amazon. I searched Alico wind turbines and you come up with a few horizontals. But that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for da -da -da, the vertical axis. Well, here we go. You notice, first thing that comes up is it's got one star rating with three reviews. Not very good. Let's keep going down. Okay, oh, oh, go up a little bit. Now you got the description, now you got the specs. Well, the first thing I want to see is a warranty. What, what do we got for a warranty on this? <clears throat> Warranty, if you'd like a copy of the warranty for product, you can contact the manufacturer directly. So they, they don't have any warranties posted. Uh, that, that worries me a little bit. Okay, let's go back over to, there we go, and we look through the product info, and I don't see any certifications. That's something you really want to look for too, are certifications. And plus, they call the manufacturer Alico, and it's not. The manufacturer is Typemar, T-Y-P-M-A-R, out of China who's supposedly bankrupt. Now one thing I do want to point out, does it come with the charge controller? No. And I got the wrong turbine as well. Know someone spelt it wrong, but you, you know that, that stuff you get you got to be aware of. Not only do they get shipped the wrong product, but there's no electronics with it. You got to get that for yourself. Now down, we're down to the uh, recommendations, all one star. This one says damaged, half work, half don't, cheap Chinese crap. Well, yeah, he did two orders, and they were both damaged. I, I've installed four. The first two worked, lots of power. The next two never did. Can't repair them. After assembly, putting it together, found out that didn't work. No matter how much wind is present, we're not produced more than 35 watts of power. Constant low voltage error. Working with the dealer and factory, and as soon as I proved the product was uh, faulty, the factory stopped talking to him. There you go. So this poor guy... You know, he said, hey, look, it doesn't work, and click, uh, he get the dial tone. So anyways, if I'm going to order one of these, I'd probably better consider all the bad ratings that go along with it, and at least get myself the three-year protection, so I got Amazon behind it. Let's go ahead and add that to the cart, Kaler. Now, since this thing never had a charge controller, we can't run it without one. It looks like this one might be it right here. Let's go ahead and get Alico. 12-volt charge controller. There you go. Order it up. Well, let's look at it. Uh, they give you the specs. Uh, we might as well add the protection plan for 7 bucks for this one. Go down a little bit, Kayla. Right there. Three years. Okay, now go down. I want to see the reviews on this guy. Because, you know, it's got three stars. It does have three. And actually, if you look one more time, no certifications. And I bet it's got the same non-warranty. Okay, we come down, and those are the questions. There we go, most recent. This is the one I want to show you. One star. It's not a sales pitch like some of these others. How about this three star? Problem is you don't know if it's working or not. I'm replacing with a different model. Why would you give something three stars you're replacing? Anyways, this one, one star. Connected as instructions. He's an electrical engineer, so, you know, you got, you got to trust this guy a little bit. Over temp LED was on. Then it shut off when the turbine was connected. That's crazy as hell. When the wind was blowing, it was producing three phase, nine to ten volts, but no output because they were never able to get the batteries charged, even though they weren't fully charged. Poor guy took too long to install, missed a 30 day policy. Here's what he said Junk. Don't buy and keep looking for a controller. I should have listened to the bad review. Well, unfortunately for me, I'm not. Because I, I want to do some testing and, and, and compare this for you guys. So now we've got that in cart. We're proceeding to checkout. What do we got? Oh, we got the two items and we got the two protections. Oh, what's this? Order summary, estimated tax to be collected. Well, first of all, are they co collecting on the protection plans? 
I didn't know protection plans were, I mean, that's insurance. I didn't know it was taxable. But secondly, this is renewable energy products, which in the state of Minnesota are tax-free. So how the heck is Amazon charging sales tax on a product which Minnesota statute specifically calls out to be tax-free? I'm going to have to investigate that. Well, let's go place the order, Kaler. Order has been placed. So, there you go, folks. Should be here Monday, just a couple of days away. There you go, should be here Monday, a couple of days away. And when we get it, we'll do a nice little unboxing video, if it shows up. And then we're going to put that thing together, and on a nice windy day, we're going to see if this thing really does work or doesn't work. Well, thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.